Okay, let's uh, walk through uh, quickly on Twilio how to take a Twilio phone number and set it up so that it forwards to your client in a message so that the call gets forwarded to your client. So we can also introduce an IVR, so press one to connect. So let's just kind of look at that process right now. So first of all, we're in Twilio. We look at going and we set up Studio. So we're gonna go to a, create a new flow. We're gonna call this one, uh, the client is home renovation, SKT, Saskatoon. We're gonna create it from, star, uh, from scratch. And we're gonna bring in a few things. We're gonna bring in gather, we're gonna bring in um, add twimmel redirect and we're gonna bring in a message. So we're gonna first connect the message to here. We're gonna click on this and we're gonna say uh, new lead from, and this one is home renovation Saskatoon. And we're gonna use some trigger code um, so you use the two frilly brackets, trigger uh, it from, and then we're gonna type in body. Again, we're gonna trigger um, trigger message uh, body. So that means that the text message is gonna say new lead from Home Renovation Saskatoon, and it's gonna give you who it's from and what the message is. Next, you're gonna select uh, where you wanna send that message. So my customer, I'm going to send it to his cell phone number. So he gets an instant notification that there's a new lead for him to follow up on. Click save. Let's take the incoming call and connect it to gather. This is the IVR. This is the thing that says press one to connect. We're gonna select, I'm in Canada. We're gonna select Alice. And there's nothing else we do there. We click save. And then we're gonna click uh, redirect. And we now need to go create a Twimmel bin and we're gonna put the URL in here. So we'll click save for that for now. And let's go over here to a Twimmel bin. And we're gonna create a new Twimmel bin. This one is home uh, renovation Saskatoon. Uh, now I'm going to um, bring in the phone number. I just, just so it's easy for me to know what these are for, what phone numbers, this is how I do it and how I'd like to have it done. And this is going to be the whisper. Okay. So just give me a second. Uh, okay. And I'm going to bring in this document and this is the whisper code that we're gonna look for. And because, the, because this part is already there, I won't need all that. I'll just take this part here, copy that. I'll put it here. And now I'm going to say uh, new lead from home renovation uh, Saskatoon. So when the call comes in and my customer receives it, he'll know it's a call from Home Renovation Saskatoon, okay? Uh, that, that didn't work out, sorry. I just deleted something I needed to put, um, sorry, response. Uh, let's change that. I have to leave that end in. So it's new lead from Home Renovation. Oh. My goodness, Saskatoon. We're gonna create that. And then I need to copy this URL down. So I copy it and I'm going to put that URL. This is just my little document, just so I have it. So I'll come back to that. So that's there, I need that for my whisper. So we're gonna click save. So that's created. I'm gonna go back to Twimmel bins and we're gonna create, so we created the whisper. Now we need to create the forwarding. So uh, home renovation, uh, Saskatoon. This is the same thing, the number. And this is going to be forwarding. Okay, and then in that document, I need this information. Again, 
this is already there. So I just need this part. Copy that. Let's move that out of the way. Let's put that in there. Okay, so there's two things we want. The whisper code that I just took is right there. I copied it. So we're going to copy it again. And we're going to place it between these quotations. Okay, that's there. And now I'm going to put my client's number in there. Where do, oops, where do I want, where do I want this number to go? And it's going to be plus, again, you would insert your own client's information here. Okay, it's valid. Let's create that. And now I need, this is almost like the funnel. This is the main one. I need this. So I'm, oops, I'm going to copy that. I'm going to bring that here in my document. It's easy to have a document going for each of these as you do it. And I'm going to need this URL, the forwarding code. So we're going to click save. And now we're going to go back to the studio flow, the flu, the flow that we previously set up, but we needed to enter the URL and the URL I want to enter here is the forwarding URL. Okay. So we're going to put that here. We're going to click save. Okay, we're going to click publish. We're going to click publish. So the flow is live. Now we just want to go and connect the phone number to that. Okay, so let's go look for that phone number in your, um, oops, sorry, in your account. So I'm going to say SAS Katoon. Okay, there's the number. I'm going to click on it. And now all we want to do is connect what happens when a phone call comes in. So a call comes in, we're going to use studio flow, which is what I just created. And we're going to select home renovation Saskatoon. Perfect. Now do the same thing for when a message comes in, we're going to select studio flow. We're going to select home renovation and we're going to select save. Perfect. Okay. Now, I'm going to grab my phone and hopefully uh, everything works as it should. So let me just do this. Um, 306 518 7637. We're just going to type in test and we should get a message back. Perfect. So if someone texts that line, it notifies your business owner that, hey, you've got a new lead. Here's the phone number it came in from and this is the message. Okay. Now let's try to dial that number. Press one to connect. So it says press one to connect. Perfect. It's, it's going to dial me because that's the number I have in the system. New lead from home renovation Saskatoon. And it said new lead from home renovation Saskatoon. Testing one, two, one, two, one, two, test, test, test. We'll end that, we'll end that. Okay, perfect. So now we'll scroll up here and we'll look at call logs. We will look at incoming and there is our call. Now we can listen to it. And it said new lead from home renovation Saskatoon, testing one, two, one. That's it, it's that simple. Thank you.